For me, the co-curricular program has never really let me see the world. I've, obviously, I've been to India, been to New Zealand, and it's also given me that sense of pride I have in the school. Uh, so I came in year seven. Uh, I've been a student here since year seven. Um, every year since then, I've done debating and rugby union. Uh, this year, I was lucky enough to take part in the St Edmunds Musical, Disco Inferno. Uh, I've met some of my best mates through Disco Inferno. It's a great way to meet the girls from St Clair's as well. The opportunities I've had to go over to Japan and New Zealand now have obviously changed me as a person. Being able to engage with different cultures has really helped me develop myself as a person. So like, especially touching base with younger kids, I always thought it's really important because when I was a younger kid, I only had a few people who touched base with me and they showed me the right way. So I always feel it's really important that we keep in touch with the younger kids so that when they're older and when they're our age and when they're seniors, they know what to do as well. They know how to touch base with little kids. Just make everything a bit easier, a bit funner so they can enjoy high school a bit more and get the most out of it. And one of the opportunities that is offered here at this college is that you're able to go down and coach some of the younger fellas. For me personally, I coach under 11s Div 2 rugby every Wednesday, get to their games early on Saturday and it, it just allows me to feel that, that I am giving something back to this college and I am doing something that is more than just me. So I was lucky enough to go to parliamentary debating, which is, I've done that every year since year eight which is kind of like a taste in politics type thing. So if you do regular seasonal debating, you'll do parliamentary debating. Uh, go up, you get a taste of parliament. And this year I was lucky enough to coach the seven and eight team there. So I went along, I showed them the ropes, helped them write their speeches, stuff like that. I made sure they, they all got the most out of the day. So obviously in year 11 and 12, you come to the stage where you're playing opens footy or opens cricket. It's first 15, first 11. And that obviously means a lot to the boys. Like with cricket, you get your baggy blue. With, with first 15, with rugby, you get that white jersey that everyone all obviously speaks about. There's nothing like getting up on stage front and centre and performing in front of five or 600 people. Uh, it's an experience that you just, you just can't write, you can't say about this. Like, there's no words that describe how fun it is. For me, the co-curricular program is never really let me see the world. I've obviously, I've been to India, been to New Zealand, and it's also given me that sense of pride I have in the school. But the mates I have, I've created, will last me a lifetime. 